And the reason I'm doing this video today is because I stumbled on some really, really rich kids on Instagram over the weekend and I decided to do some investigation as to how these guys are making so much money and it turns out that they are in the make money online niche. These guys are selling products on the internet and they've made over 1 million US dollars in revenue, okay? So today I'm going to be dissecting bit by because I make most of my money online anyway. So this is my space, this is my niche, this is my industry. So I'm going to be breaking it down bit by bit, right? How you can go about making your first $1 million on the internet. All right, guys, so if you're interested in that, I suggest you stick around till the very end of this video. All right, guys, so back to what I was saying now. Like I was saying earlier, guys, I stumbled on some really, really rich kids and I found out that these guys are actually making so much money from the internet. In fact, the reason why I know this is legitimate is because there's a company called ClickFunnels, right? ClickFunnels is like a web-based platform that hosts your website, right? So is I don't want to go into too much detail as to what ClickFunnels does, but ClickFunnels basically is an online platform whereby you can host your web pages. So it's supposed to be like a funnel whereby your customers come in and then it takes them from page to page to page and basically educates your, your, your potential customers and then sells them on the product you have to sell. I'll take that again. ClickFunnels is a web-based platform. It's kind of like a website, but it's more tailored to selling, right? So if you go on a ClickFunnels uh, web page, it will basically pre-educate you about the product and then take you to the next page whereby it's going to pre-educate you some more until you come out a customer, okay? So a lot of these kids are using ClickFunnels to build a sales machine and then they, they run ads through the sales machine and then what happens, they spit out a customer. So now ClickFunnels itself had an event about two weekends ago called Funnel Hacking Live. Now Funnel Hacking Live was where they were pretty much giving kids like plaques. Like you know how Michael Jackson probably has like 20 million records sold. Like you know those plaques? Literally guys, ClickFunnels had an event and they were awarding these plaques to these kids. Guys, I'm, I'm talking about these kids. Have, obviously not all of them are between 18 to 21. Some are a lot older than that. But this last Funnel Hacking Live, I saw the most amount of kids I've ever seen. And you know, ClickFunnels giving them this award just legit legitimizes the fact that they are actually making this money online revenue real life money um so the first award i think goes to people who make 100k there's an award for people who make 1 million and then there's 10 million so recently at this funnel hacking live um click funnels the owner of click funnels his name is russell bronson russell literally just gave awards to people who made 25 50 75 and 100 million us dollars in online sales revenue so guys I mean, this shit is a no-brainer. There's so much money to be made on the internet, right? So that's exactly why I wanted to put this video together to basically explain to you guys how you can go about making this kind of money, how you can, you know, start getting awarded by companies like ClickFunnels and Shopify for making over a million dollars in online revenue. All right, guys, so there are two ways you can go about making a million dollars from the internet, right? Um, the first way is by selling products, and the second way is by selling services. I know this sounds very broad and all that, but I'm going to be going into detail as to how you can go about this. Now, for the purpose of this video, uh, I'm going to be speaking about how you can make a million dollars selling products online. Okay, so maybe in the subsequent videos, I can speak about how you can make a million dollars selling your services. But in this video, we're going to focus on how you can go about making a million dollars by selling products online. Now, guys, um, I'm going to start by obviously telling you guys my own experience from making money online and obviously how you guys can relate that to your, to your own journey as well. So the first way I actually encourage you guys to go about um, selling products online is actually by selling physical products so selling products online can be classified into two aspects of things right they're selling products they're selling digital products physical products and digital products right um so let's take physical products how do you go about making a million bucks from selling physical products online um i'm pretty certain you must have come across all these kids on instagram selling stuff on shopify and stuff like that um there's a business model called drop shipping, right? So drop shipping basically is when 
um, you have your e-commerce store and then you have your suppliers from Aliexpress which is in China you run Facebook ads to your store people like the products um, let's take this this really nice Garnier hand intensive seven-day cream or whatever so let's say you have a nutrition store right is this classified as nutrition whatever it is it's a cream <laughs> you actually don't have this cream right so but i mean you have the pictures and everything you list them on your store when people come running to your store they buy from your store and then you take that money and purchase it on aliexpress so usually this hand cream can probably be going for on aliexpress for about maybe a dollar fifty or two dollars you can literally sell this cream on your store for about 15 bucks now this business model is known as drop shipping i've mentioned this in my previous videos now you can drop ship for a while now the issues I had with dropshipping was the fact that, you know, guys, this your suppliers are based in China. Guys, the shipping time from China will literally kill you. I remember my uh, my online store. We used to dropship from China as well. My customer service agents were swarmed in so much emails. Right, guys, people were messaging us, asking us, "Where? When are we gonna get our products? When are we gonna get our products? When are we?" Because the shipping time from China is between seventy-five to thirty-five days. Imagine you buy something online and you have to wait like 17 to 35 days to get your product. Imagine you'll be so mad. And that's the first issue. Now, because of the shipping time, right, I started to realize that uh, we were not getting a lot of return customers, right, uh, and stuff like that. So you can start off with drop shipping because with drop shipping, you probably need about between $300 to $500 to kick it off because you need to pay for your Shopify store. Um, which is about 23 bucks a month. Listing the products, getting a supply from AliExpress is totally free. Where most of your money is gonna go in, where most of your money is gonna go is into running Facebook ads. And once you can gain some traction and then you start selling some products, obviously, you know, you start to make all this money. Um, your margins are probably gonna be about 50 to 60%. So 60% is gonna go up to cost, 40% is gonna be your profit. You can start off like this. This is how a lot of these kids online are making millions. So you've made all this money from drop shipping. However, you're not getting a lot of repeat customers because of the shipping time. What you need to do is you, all the money you've made from drop shipping, you need to get your ass over to China. I know with all this coronavirus and all that, um, you don't really need to go there. What you can do is you can tell your supplier to make you custom made creams for your brand. Put your brand name on it and stuff like that and then order them in bulk to wherever you are. So what this does is it reduces shipping time because you have the inventory, because you have the products, you can literally ship to your customers within three to five days. And what this does is it helps your customer retention. Okay. Uh, what I'm trying to say in essence is that if somebody buys from you because of how quickly you shipped it out to them, chances are that when they see your offer again, you know, um, they're going to buy from you again, as opposed to if you're drop ship. I mean, if you waited 35 days for an item to get to you, you will never buy from that store again. And the second thing is it helps your marketing budget, building a branded store. Now, guys, I'm trying to explain to you guys how you can start and how you can scale to a million bucks. That's the essence of this, right? And it also helps your marketing budget because let's say you were spending about 15 to 20 dollars trying to acquire a customer on facebook once you acquire a customer they now become part of your ecosystem what do i mean by ecosystem they now become on your they now go on your email address on your email list because you have to remember when somebody buys something from you they provide you with their email their first name their full name their last name their data brother all that and the address so you literally capture all this information now once you capture all this information you can now go on your emails and remarket these things to them obviously not the same product if you have a new collection and stuff like that so you can realize that you can see that over time your marketing budget starts to reduce your marketing expense starts to reduce because you're acquiring customers up front they come into your ecosystem they're within your email list and literally all you need to do is just send them out emails over time and then they start to repurchase from you again so guys this is how you can make the transition from a drop shipping store to a branding store and then you can literally scale this stuff and then you start making a million dollars online so guys this is the best way to go about making a million bucks online by selling physical products physical products 
I like physical products. I, I have an online store, so uh, I like to sell physical products. Although, when you're kicking off, the margins are not going to be so great. You have to remember this. The margins are not going to be so great. I know people, because of how much, they, because Facebook ads are becoming so expensive, right? I know a lot of people who are constantly complaining that all my days, Facebook ads are so expensive. That's why I keep telling you guys, right? Spend the money upfront on Facebook, acquire the customer, and then use emails to follow up on them and then upsell them on different products you have. Now guys, I'm gonna be making subsequent videos in the future whereby I'm gonna be taking you to my screen and then I'm gonna be walking you through the process of actually drop shipping. But in this video, I wanted to speak to you guys about how you can actually make a million bucks selling products online. All right, guys, so the second way you can go about making a million dollars online is known as selling digital products. So we've spoken about physical products, which are which I showed you guys are these. Um, I spoke to you guys as to how you can start a store and scale it, how you can use 500 bucks to start a store and then scale it into a million dollars by building a branded store. Now, the second way you can go about this is selling digital products. Now, I'm a fan of this. I have, I have, well over, I have about four digital products. Um, one of them being my FX course and stuff like that. So what are digital products, right? This video you're watching right now is a digital product, right? Information are digital products. Ebooks are digital products. Training series, anything online, right, that you consume. Content, information online you consume are digital products. Now, you can create a very, very valuable digital product whereby, let's say you're really good at something, right? Um, probably very good at making throw pillows. Um, you're probably good at making scented candles. You're, everybody's good at something, right? Or you're a professional at something. All you need to do, right? Sit your ass down, get your camera like this, put it in front of you, outline all the things that you know very well, and then come on camera and teach people. Show them what you know, provide value. You guys come on my YouTube every week, you see me, I provide value. Now, the digital products that you're seeing right in front of you right now is free. I have the paid ones, which actually go in debt, like if you wanted to learn how to do e-com properly, or if you wanted to learn how to do Forex properly, you would have to pay for my digital products. So same thing, you guys can do the same thing as well. It doesn't have to be making money online, it can be anything. I remember one of the examples I gave you guys, it was, it was about one guy who, was, who knew how to make paper guns, right? Potato guns, literally. Literally, he will make a gun and then he put a potato inside and then potato will shoot out, literally. So, whatever thing it is you're good at. Now, once you package this together, it should have some really nice videos. The videos should be maybe, I suggest you have at least nine modules, right? And then write out some stuff, like type it out, PDF, make it really nice. Go on teachable.com, www.teachable.com, and then upload this content on there, right? Lock it up and put a price tag. It's so easy. Teachable is free. They only charge you when somebody buys a course from you. So what you then do is once you put together, now you have a product. When you put together 10 different videos with different write-ups as the, you know, teaching people about stuff that you're really good at, that's a product already. Put it on Teachable, that's a platform, then go on Facebook, right? And then create a Facebook ad and say, hey guys, so I've just put together this amazing online course as to how you can make throw pillows. Um, the reason why I put this course together was because I saw a lot of people are not so good at making throw pillows and I have well over 15 years of making throw pillows. Obviously, you don't have to need to have 15 years, right? So you can just, you know, just sell them, create an ad and sell them, hey, I created this. If you're interested, um, click the link below and you can access the course or click the link below to find out more about this online course. And there you go. Facebook ads are so cheap. For about $25, you can acquire a customer. So let's say your courses are going for about maybe $99 to $200, $100 to $200. For every 20 bucks you spend on ads, you can acquire a customer. You can get people to buy from you. So guys, this is exactly what I mean. This is exactly how these kids are making over a million dollars on the internet. And another thing that they do is a lot of them build their following, right? You can literally build your following on Instagram, but it takes a lot of time. When you build your following, right, you still need to have a product to sell. It still needs to be either a physical product or a digital product, right? So 
physical or digital. You decide what you want to do. And then once you do that, I've given you these two platforms. For physical product, the best place to go to sell your physical products is on Shopify, right? If you don't know where to get products from, visit AliExpress, list them on Shopify. The second way you can go about this is digital products. Record videos, put together content, go on Teachable, put it on there, and then you can sell it. Both, both of these means, if you're looking for customers to buy this stuff from you, Facebook is the best place to go to. For about $25 to $35, you can, for every $25 to $35 you spend, you acquire a customer. For every $35 bucks you spend, somebody buys from you. So just imagine if you have a course that's going for about $150, right? Spend $30, bucks, make $150, profit $120. Win-win for everybody. And the good thing about digital products is that you can sell as many as you want. Like, you can duplicate. Like this video, I can duplicate it a billion times, right? So, guys, these are the two ways you can go about selling products online and making a million dollars. Um, please don't forget to smash the subscribe button. Comment below if you found this video helpful. And I will see you guys in the very next video. Love you guys and peace out. Peace, peace, bye, bye.